Welcome back to another episode of Survivor Man. Last time, both Fang and Bill survived, and they'll be advancing to the next round with Nia and Dwight. In today's episode, we'll have Lori and David go at it. They are probably the hardest ones to do because David has no mither, and then Lori has object of obsession, which could help me or it could completely screw me over. We'll see what happens. But first up, we have Loy with her three teachable perks being Soul Survivor, Object of Obsession, and Decisive Strike. She has her first aid kit with her butterfly tape and her bandages, and for an offering, Boldness Blood Points. Now, what's going to be difficult about Lori is Object of Obsession. This perk basically makes it so the killer can see me and I can see the killer within a certain range. It only activates when I look in the killer's direction, and if I hit the killer's terror radius, it'll deactivate no matter what. But I'm hoping I don't actually get screwed over by this perk. But with that, will Lori survive? Okay, Lori, you're gonna die, but how fast will it take for you to die? Okay, I don't see the killer. Oh, it's a Freddy, that's probably why. And there he is. Well, time to look at the ground. That's basically how you use Object of Obsession. You just look at the ground. Or maybe at the sky. This will be like one of those challenge videos where it's like you always have to look up. Oh, he's already like on his way here. Oh gosh, that's where he is. Okay, maybe I should stay looking around because clearly it doesn't mean anything to not look around. Well, I'm probably gonna die. Oh crap. Also, Freddy um, brought a Mori. So, oh hey, there's a booby trap there. Is he gonna place something? Oh my, I'm gonna loop it. Okay, I'm gonna loop it again. Oh, he is still chasing. Dang it, I thought he turned back. Okay, I can make it. Dang it. Okay. I did make it, but I'm not gonna make it loop again. I have to get to a pallet. I did not like this. Stop your shenanigans, buddy. I don't like what you're trying to do to me. I don't know where you're trying to do it at. Oh, crap. Watch this, you'll never see- He saw that coming a mile away. I'm sad now. Z-block. Hemorrhage. Uh, I don't really care about hemorrhage. Just leave me alone. Don't do it, don't do it. No. I don't want to die. I want to live a good life. Okay, but well, they were pairing a generator there, and that person's just crouching around. Please. Leave me alone. Okay, buddy, come heal me. There we go. Jeff is here. Thank you. Okay, I'll wake you up, Jeff. Let's just get you out of this nightmare. Can okay, now heal me. Thank you. Look at that Freddy boy coming to kill me. We can get this heal off. Yep. Don't even try. I don't want to die. Watch this. He's gonna want to mori me. Ha! <laughs> he can't mori me. If I have D strike. <laughs> Decisive strike. <laughs> A fast vault. <laughs> I'm going to die. <laughs> Why was that a slow vault? Come on. Come on now. Yes, he's going after the claw dead. I get to live. I don't get to get moried. Is he actually going to stay chasing her? He is. Oh my gosh. Thank you, claw dead. I need to stop looking at him. But I want to look at him. Okay, I'm going to heal up, go wake myself up, and try to do a generator because this Freddy is going to be the death of me. But yeah, let's go. Okay, white orb alarm clock thing. I don't actually understand like, what the heck this is. I guess it's an alarm clock, but I don't think alarm clocks look like that. Aw, somebody went down. Is that the claw that I feel bad now? I'm gonna do a generator anyways. Oh, there's a ruin now. I had no idea. He's coming here. Maybe not. Oh, crap. Hide behind this wall. I don't like this object of obsession. So yeah, if you still don't actually understand how it works, basically whenever I see him, he sees me. 
but I get to dictate whenever I see him. That's like the only reason why I gotta have this perk, because I'm in control of when I get to see him. Up, oh, stop it. I want to find the totem, but I can't like look this way. But I know I have to. Okay, well, here, Claudette, I can heal you. Yes, yes, I can. Oh, I, I'm in the, I'm in the dream state now. Wake me up. Where? Is that him there? Okay, now you just need to wake me up. Thank you. Wake me up, Pumpkin King. Thank you. Oh, now I have to wake you up. Look at this. We just share. Wait, wait. if we broke a totem, what is still left? I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna do this generator with this claw dead. That person went down right there. He's coming. No! Don't hurt Claudette. Claudette de Dette. She doesn't deserve this cruelty. That person is getting hooked. Where's this totem? I want to find it. Ah, uh, here's the Mori. Oh, maybe not. Okay, well, you know what? I'll just pick this person up then. If I can't find... Is it? Yeah, he's back. Crap. Well. Nope. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Okay, he's going back. Ah, where is the totem? Don't tell me it's in this thing. Okay, it's not good. Hey, Claudette, would you like a heal? I can heal you. Well, that's not what I meant. We need to go. We don't need to leave. I can just heal you right here. Come on, Claudette. We're safe. Come on. We don't need to hide behind a wall to heal you. Look at him. Getting hooked over there. I can't look. I gotta stop looking at his direction. Here we go. He's somewhere. That's where he happens to be. That's cool. It's fine. I can work with that. I can work with that. Oh man, where is this totem? And I hate having to wake up like every 10 seconds it feels like. You wake up and then you're back in it instantly. No counter. Okay, he's going back to them. Man, where is this totem? I'm going to... Is this it? No. Okay, I'm just going to heal up and then I'm going to look for the totem again. Well, my med kit's gone but I'm fully healed. I think Lori's the first person to actually completely use their medkit. Like, deplete it 100%. It's gotta be in the middle or in that building. Actually, I'm gonna wake up and then I'm going to do this generator. Come on, Lori, just break the alarm clock across your face. Thank you. Generator time. Oh, she's getting moried. Well, that's annoying. But on the bright side, we're down to just two generators left. There's still a ruin. And this Kate is injured. But I can help her. Here, here. Oh, crap. You know what? He's going to teleport here. And then he's going to go after the scratch marks that lead. Yep. That's right. Team player here. Saying screw the Kate. So I don't actually care. Uh, I need to find another generator to do. And Kate's already down. Now I'm sad. Is she gonna get moored? Or is it just an ivory? She's getting picked up. I don't know. Okay, it sounds like there's a generator in here getting done. Found the hatch. That's cool. He can't teleport yet. It shouldn't be recharged enough. But I'll be able to tell if he's coming this way. Okay, well, he is kind of coming this way. I'm just gonna walk. I realize I just... I have Soul Survivor now. Okay, well... He, he didn't actually come. Ooh, what's this? Cool. I got a flashlight. I'm just gonna keep doing the generator. This generator is about to pop. Hopefully one of them have adrenaline. Neither of them had it. Oh, there's a noed. Okay, both the exit gates are there and there. That person's getting picked up. Um... 
Maybe this Kate's gonna get the door open. Oh, I wonder if he has remembered me. I should be opening the door or not. Not the other person. Okay, well. Yeah, he's coming. Okay. Oh, come on, Kate. Dang it, the Kate sold me out. Yeah, she's gonna get caught, but I know where the hatch is. So hopefully, I can just get to the hatch. I should have kept walking around the hill. I just didn't think she was gonna do that. Oh no, she's gonna bring him exactly to where the hatch is. Gosh darn it. I don't have unbreakable. I think I'm dead. Well, we were close. I'm gonna see if I can just try to sneak around. Maybe. He's about to just close the hatch. God, please. No! No! There's no way for me to stand up. If only I was like right behind him. Should I just give myself up? It's not like I can do anything. Yeah, I'm right here. You can just kill me. Thank you. Uh, Ebony's. <laughs> the results are in, and Lori will not be advancing to the next round, unfortunately. Up next, we have David with his three teachable perks being We're Gonna Live Forever, Dead Hard, and No Mither. He doesn't actually have a fourth perk because uh, We're Gonna Live Forever is already part of his three teachables. For an item, instead of having a med kit because No Mither makes it so he can't even heal himself, he's gonna have a toolbox with scraps and clean rag. It's kind of like the toolbox version of a med kit with the scraps and the clean rag, more charges, faster speed. And for an offering, survival blood points. Now, what makes it hard for David to survive is No Mither. This perk makes it so I'm going to be injured constantly. I can't heal up at all. I'm going to be in the injured state, I'm going to be crying in pain, but I won't leave pools of blood and I'll be able to recover from the dying state. That's about it. But with that, will David survive? The broken no mither David. Will he even survive? Will he even get close? I do have dead hard, so um, there's that. And the Huntress is right there. That is so fun! I... I'm... more confused than I ever have been. Okay, she's still on me. I'm gonna go around this way. And we're just gonna keep doing this back and forth. She ain't gonna throw a hatchet. Oh, she did. She finally threw the hatchet. I didn't even use dead hard. I'm, I looked away and then I looked back and I saw it fling and then I just forgot to press X. I forgot. On the hook, David goes. This is not gonna last long. And I feel like there was literally nothing I could have done. I literally started and like was immediately found. That was kind of bad. Also, this map is really bad. No mither, no problem. Okay, Claudette, come free me from my torture. Thank you, no need to heal. Is he already coming back for me? Literally leave me alone. Okay, she's there. Let me just do a generator in peace. That generator's done. Okay, so we got one generator done. Is she seriously coming straight for me? Okay, that's cool. I love this. I made a huge bad. Oh, sorry, ma'am. Well, I should not be camping pallets, but I'm at the point where I'm getting screwed over. Oh, that was weird lag. Can she just not? 
Okay, that was a cool one. I should not run into rocks. Nope, no, nope, no. Nope. Okay. She missed me. If I go there. Yep. Okay, dead hard for the win. Get away from that basement. Literally has like the biggest boner for me. I'm wasting so many pallets, but it's like, could you just leave? Oh, thank goodness. That was awful. Hey, the generator I started for half a second. Let's finish it. Okay, she's, oh my gosh, why? They need to be more lenient about getting off the generator when a skill check like that appears. I'm just gonna hide in this locker. She probably saw me get in this locker. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to go and help that person for my We're Gonna Live Forever stack. There we go, got my dead hard back. We have two generators done, two hooks. Unfortunately, I did waste a lot of pallets. In my defense, she was not leaving me alone. And I have no mither. Okay, I'm probably about to farm her. Okay, dead hard again. Duck that hatchet. Oh, I thought she was gonna... Oh my gosh, well I got my stack. Put me back on the hook. I'd like to believe I could get through this. Okay. I have been saved with borrow time. I don't want to sabo the hook. I want to stop that. Okay, she's chasing him. Which is good news, because I am death hook. I really just don't want to die. <laughs> I want David to live. Because it'd just be fun. I'm done another generator. Or I should say my first generator. I don't know what people are doing or where the killer is. But I know I'm probably screwed. But that's okay. I did tap this generator. It still got kicked. But I shall do this generator. Never mind. Apparently she's coming back. I am probably gonna die here. I... I didn't look back. I'm dead. Well... That was fun. Not really. Not at all. I'm so glad this happened. Goodbye, David. He lived a good life. And with that, David has died, but is anybody truly surprised? He had no mither, he was not gonna last very long. So as it turns out, both Lori and David won't be advancing to the next round. It's unfortunate though. Ah, uh, Lori, she was so close, but I should have just kept going around that rock. But I didn't see any hope with David with no mither. At rank two or whatever, having no mither is basically, you're screwed. There is no getting out of that. It was such slim chance of David actually surviving. Next time, we will have Quentin and Detective Tap go at it, see who will survive and who will die. But with that, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Survivor Man, and I shall see you in the next one. Goodbye.